What do you mean? Hello guys, I'm Anuj from Okus Property Group. Uh, today we are going back to school. Today we are covering the back to school topic. Um, we oh, actually I'm not alone. Hello, where's my team? Please come in. Hi, Hi. everyone. Welcome to Okus Show on Okus TV. Um, on my right there is Ami and we have our newest member of Okus family. Uh, Drasti Shah. Yes, hi everyone. How are you? So, uh, how do you feel like working here with us? Drasti? Um, it's very fun and thrilling. I've been working here since the last couple of months, and you know, it's been very exciting. There's not a day that's gone by where I've been bored, and everybody's so lovely. All that's the staff. Good. That's good. That's that talks about Okus. Now, yeah. Right? <laughs> um, so, today. I'm, I mean, as a parent, yeah. I'm not the dad yet, so I you don't know be. much about. Yeah, I will be soon, but I don't know much about uh, school zones or how property market um, impact, like what impact school zone has on properties. So you are being, you are you guys being parents. How do you feel like uh, schools should be closer to your? home is it convenient how convenient it is it's for too convenient if both parents are working uh, then it will be so convenient if school is very nearby because it's very easy when you are rushing the morning and uh, so it's so easy to just drop the kid and back, go back to the work and especially when it's walkable distance yeah obviously if if they are living with the grandparents then it's it's a benefit that even they can drop the kids to the school it's yeah. always good to have yeah. to stay in a school catchment area yeah, that's good to see you have done your schooling here yeah yeah all all 12 13 years of schooling all done here okay how was your experience it was beautiful it was really nice but um uh we moved quite far from my school back in year 10 when I was in year 10 okay. so in the morning every every morning it was at least a 30 45 minute drive to school going from Point Cook all the way to Tani so I mean I definitely agree that schools must be you know in like the in an area where it's easy and convenient to travel uh, because traveling in the morning in the traffic is so hectic it's a nightmare yes. yes. some of the suburbs yes. like say if you go to Burwood or Glen Beverly there are good schools there, but traffic during school time, the traffic uh, is yes, bumper yes, to bumper it's, and it's, um, it's very difficult. It's to, horrible, yeah. honestly. <laughs> and, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I feel like school should be very nearby where the student can walk or ride by their own. It's environment friendly also. Yeah, that's true. true. That's, that's true. true. That's student, true. Kids can, you know, ride their bike or walk to school every day. So that's definitely so true. Yeah. So yeah, so property, like now being in a real estate, I'm not a dad, but being in real estate, I have noticed that property values goes up by 10 to 13% if that, um, if you are in that school catchment area. Obviously. And sometime like, yes, last night I was reading an article. So some, some suburbs has like uh, 600,000 more value like a house property value, 600,000 more than same suburb, but different patch of the suburb. It's that much difference in the... So it's, yeah, it's really something to consider. Yeah, yeah. yeah like if you want to buy a, a house, it's, it's a good investment to buy a property near school catchment. Um, it's, it's a good investment for your kids, in, in your kids' study as well, if you can give good an education to them. What do you think about that? It's always good to take the house near the school area because it always, always have a good return over the property. Suppose if you are not going to stay back over on the same property and you are moving to sub next suburbs once your kid finished at school. So if you are going on the rent, means you are giving that property on the rent, you will have always higher rent than the other properties. So you are saying like it's better for investors as well? As well, yes, to... and definitely. And if you observe the properties uh, which are very near to the school, it has like 10% more reselling price than the other properties. Oh wow, yeah. that's, yeah, that's, that's a... incredible. Yeah. So it's a good investment. Yeah. So yeah. guys, if you want to buy a property near school area, Please do not hesitate to contact us, yeah? Obviously. <laughs> we are here to assist you in any manner if you want to do some research on schools and if you want to 
buy property near school, just let, let us know. Yeah? Yes, and if you have observed in the good schools, which is located like Caroline Springs, the Coral Creek Primary School, then the Delimute and the Delimute Primary Schools, so it has very good price of the houses over there compared to the rest of the area, if you have observed. So yeah, if you yeah. go to the like Caroic, um, Caroic primary schools and if you try to find this uh, house over there, it's very difficult to find over there. Okay, that's yeah. good, that's good. Yeah. Uh, so what, uh, what school your kid go to? Coral Creek primary Coral, school. Ah, that's why you're promoting them, isn't it? <laughs> um, which school you went to? So? I went to Thomas Carr College in Tarnate. In Tarnate, yeah. okay. So today we have a very special guest as well. His name is Avi. Uh, Avi is uh, Amis son. Yeah. Hi, Avi. Hi. How are you? Hey, how are you? So, good. So, what, do you want to introduce yourself? What's your name? Let everyone know. Look at the camera. My name is Avi. Yeah. And how old are you, Avi? Um, eight. Eight. Wonderful. And what school are you going to? Kurt Quick. Oh wow, and are you starting school soon? Isn't it school season soon? Yeah. Yeah? When are you and starting? Like, where? Yeah. When 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 is school starting? Like next month. Oh wow. Cool. And and what yeah, what grade will you be in? Um like grade three maybe. Grade three. Yeah. Oh, before you were telling me grade four, man. Come no. on. <laughs> grade three, so you excited about going back to school? Are you? Yeah. Very yeah. What do you, What do you do at school? Actually, uh, first when I get at school, I start reading. Oh, reading? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I get playtime in the morning. Playtime. So what do you What do you do at playtime? Do you play games? Yeah, I play Lego and yeah, there are lots of games that I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Um. And and what would you say is your favorite subject at school? Favorite. Yeah. Math. Maths. Ah, oh, yeah. Being Indian, huh? We always know maths. Oh, wow, wonderful. So, so, have you bought your uniform and everything for yeah. school yet? Yeah. What color is What color is the uniform? Blue. <gasps> Ocus colors. So, what? see, we are. We also feel like being in a school at the moment. Yeah. But real estate school. Like yeah. you know, we wear this uniform every day. Yeah, see how yeah. you go to school, you have to wear a uniform, we have to wear yeah, a uniform, uniform too for well. real estate. Yeah? Isn't it good? <laughs> you like wearing your uniform? Yeah. You don't get bored wearing the same dress every day? Yeah. Yeah, no? no? It's always feel comfortable with the kids, other kids. Yeah. Right? Yeah, it's really good. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. So guys, if you're looking to buy a property near school in Derrimont area or in Deer Park, do not hesitate to contact us. And wrapping up, uh, we have a very special guest coming next week. I'm not going to disclose it, but uh, make sure you follow us on Ocus TV and Ocus Property Group to know more about what what is our next week's topic and who, who special guest is coming in. So exciting yeah see you guys see you. thank you for joining us today